pieds sur la corde à linge. Hein <laughs> right, Leon is one under. Tied leader. Hitting into 18. He's probably got about 140. Oh no. No, 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 no. Just deciding whether to chip yeah. or putt. He's one under here. Yeah, yeah tie totally lead on one under. He's got the putter out. This isn't easy for me. It's got a play over like five foot of fringe. And it's quick. Sit, 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 sit. It's okay. Shh. It's okay. Right, this is it. He's just got a read. Come on, boy. It's like about eight foot up the hill. It's for playoff. Come on. Playoff on 18. The boy. Right, it's on the last. First, right, it's on the first playoff hole. Both in play. Leon is that side of the fairway. Opponent hitting from probably about 150. Uphill. Plays about 20 up. Let's see what we can do. Looks good. It's just going to catch that bank. Here's the boy. Probably got about 120. Playing 135. <laughs> he's got a hook it, hasn't he? Yeah, got to turn it over a bit. Yeah, he's got that tree in the way. It wasn't, it wasn't a good second shot at all. Too soft. <coughs> Too soft. Oh. One of those. One of those. <laughs> it's got to go down there, isn't it? Oh, he's got it. He's got it. Second oh, fault. Right, Leon and <laughs> the other guy I've got. So, uh, pretty much hand in hand. Again, he's probably got about one, two, five up the hill. This is it, second player fault. Come on, Leon. No, 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 no. Kick off. It's tricky, it's really tricky from there. Oh, that's long. That's long. Sit down. Sit down. Sit. 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 sit, sit. Just got one of them. One of them. 
Nailed it. Come on in now. Yes! Come on. That's two solid pipes there. He's old. Shouldn't have any problems with this, matey boy. Solid. Okay, third player foul, here we go. He's hitting first. Very uphill line, that's heading right side of the green. It's a good shot, it's going to rip. Right, he's literally got the same shot again, just about five yards further to our left. Should fancy the shot now. That doesn't help when you back some. No. Pull. It's going. It's going. It's just there. Right, just gotta nestle this down. A couple of feet. Yeah, skip. Right, we're gonna say this guy's called Henrik. He's got a 20 footer, right to left uphill, cross green. The Iceman walks on. Right, so big, big, big dramas. Heinrichs hit it left, OB, first ball. Um, lost it, hits provisional inbounds. Leon is hitting his second shot into the green, so just realistically, just got to get this near the green. And it's going to be a win win for Leon. Oh, come on. That's a good shot there. Hey! Hey! Easy when you're fourth to win. Why? <laughs> Guy going. Going. I don't see it. I tell you what. I tell you what. It's Phil. Oh. Oh. Two putts to win. First win, isn't it? First win as a pro. This is. I reckon he. I reckon he knocks it in. Yeah. yeah. Down in front. Oh! Gay pet. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. Yay! Yeah. There he is. David Antiplanet. Could have done it before. Yeah. We like coming here because we get great cooperation. And Jose Luis Gomez, who's the director of golf here, is in a meeting at the moment, but he's a real golf man. He understands what tournament golf's all about. He understands what giving the chances to developing young golfers is all about. And I just love it. I just, there's, there's, there's nothing compares to anything I've ever, ever done. Well, sorry, well, no. Nothing professionally I've ever done comes close to <laughs> running the Gecko Tour. It's just joyful. And this boy's got some fireworks in his game. He tried his very best on the front line to lose it. Did a great job of losing it, he really did. Um, triple bogey, double bogey. He was way off the pace and all of a sudden his fireworks started igniting. A little runner birdies on the back nine. And when he's on song, this guy is one of the best players we've seen on the Gecko Tour, without a shadow of a doubt. 
Um, Ooh, keeps his head the way I think it could be. Got another future here. Got another future winner going up into the Challenge Tour and beyond. So it gives me an enormous pleasure. Nice. That our winner and your winner is Mr. Leon Fricker. Yeah. 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 In the middle. In the middle. Yeah. Right? Oh, kiss. <laughs> what about the third? Uh, <laughs> He's a basketball player, he's not a golf player. <laughs> I want to thank McKinter. I think the course was absolutely fantastic. Uh, it was nice to play the A course. It was a really good test. Secondly, Andreas, uh, thanks for letting me get my first professional win, mate. It means a lot. I never thought it would mean this much to me, but to do it here on the Gecko Tour means the world, really does. And finally, to the Gecko staff, you guys, you know how much I love this place. The players, you guys know how much I love you, and it's just a pleasure to be here and to finally get a win under my belt it means a lot. So, thank you. Watch this. Watch this. Then I'm a smart boy. I am like you get a pillow and then I'll flatten it all out. You flatten that out? What are you doing? You flatten it all out, like. That's not bad. It's Downhill, like you've got it there. It's all downhill from here. What do you guys. think? Press it down a little bit, like that. Press it down. I think we've smashed it there. <laughs> I think we smashed it. Ah, oh, look at that. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Is there any? Uh... You're not even going to start the camera. Are you? <laughs> like your lips. <laughs> um, so yeah, we got to do a recap. Firstly. He won. Bamos. Come on. Yeah. Good day. First win is a pro, isn't it? It is. It was a long time coming. Um, so it felt really good, man. Yeah. I'm really proud of myself. Um, yeah. Really wouldn't have wanted to win any other way, to be honest with you. Now it's finally done and all the nerves are over and I've actually done it. Uh, looking back having the ups and downs and trials and tribulations of the final round. Um, yeah, so they, they've seen the last like four holes, or you're like a regulation player and then the four playoff holes. Yeah. So talking through like what happened before in the front nine. Except. Front nine, got off to a perfect start, birdied the first, which was a par five. Um, second hole, played it very solidly, two putt from 15 feet. Third hole, Stuck with my low driver for the week, just was hitting low drivers to keep it in play. Um, and missed the fairway by about five five yards. Hit a tree, went out of bounds, made triple bogey. Savage. Then, like we just we talked about with the bunkers, um, next hole, plugged one in the lip. Yeah. Well, basically, they, they a lot of the courses out here, they, they fill up the, the years, the season's worth of, of sand in one go. So in each bunker there was like a foot. Like if you buried your feet in, so like pretty much every single ball that you hit in a bunker was just buried, yeah. like deep. So that was uh, another, yeah, made a good four on that hole to be honest. And then bogeyed the next hole. So was, what's, made a couple of birdie, well made one birdie, one bogey through from there on to finish the nine. Six back when I get to the ninth, 10th tee, I see the leaderboard. Um, and then the putter just caught fire. I think I, I kind of um, made a nice putt on 12, uh, bogeyed 13, saw the leaderboard, saw the leader was back to like, I think two under, so I was only four back then. Kind of thought, no one really wants to win this. Yeah. And, um, yeah, part of just I, I one putt seven seven on seven holes on the back nine and made about a hundred foot putt, so it was nice. It was good. It was good to and you closed it off with solid putts in the playoff, which was good. And to get into the playoff, eight foot. Yeah. A bit of break, tricky part. I got a nice read off my playing partner on that part. He was putting from slightly left of me. I was gonna hit it straight, but the grain was off the left. Mm -hmm. Um so I hit it on the left edge and it went in, so it was nice. To, to trust it and roll it and see it go in and then do the job in the in the playoff. Thought I thought we were gonna go on all day, but 
before yeah. I leave for yeah, bad one. Need it wasn't hands. expecting it. Wasn't expecting it. But. Nice relief, eh? <laughs> You don't have to say that, you don't have to say that, it's fine. <laughs> Made my shot in a little more comfortable, yeah. that's for sure. Um, right, to recap my tournament, it was awful, absolutely awful. Um, I shot 12 over the first round, which was really strange, because well, I've been shooting like a round par when we've been playing, and, and playing okay, but I think it's mostly just down to the fact that I haven't played competitive golf in like so long and it just takes you like you never know where your actual golf swing is until you step on a tee in competition that actually means something and then you find out where it is basically and I had no control and I just found out that I basically no scored the second day because I lost a ball and I was going real bad so I didn't want to walk back <clears throat> but I just decided for the whole week or the two days sorry that I was playing I wasn't playing golf, I was just playing like golf swing. So I was just trying to make a move and really didn't have much idea where the club face was. And on a very tight course with trouble each side, if you don't know where the club face is, you're done basically. Yeah. Um, it's also hard to make up and down around the greens because of the bunkers and stuff, but it was still like out there. I mean, the winning score, you were one under for your first six holes. And this is like some quality players at the top of the leaderboard. So that shows you it was a tough course, but. I found something afterwards. I used to always play golf by hitting lots of shapes and just focusing on the course about ball flight and then all I'm thinking about is path and face. That's all I'm thinking about on the course and just like feeling it. Um, and I've kind of, I'm gonna take that to the next tournament which is tomorrow. So hopefully we should get do a lot better. Best shot from this week? Best shot. Do you know what? As soon as I like mixed up my technique and just went back to playing field shots to finish off the tournament after I know scored like on 18 to see like two best shots a week. Two best shots a week. Little all control week. cut off the tee, then draw it into a back flag, 10 foot belly putt on 18, which is quite hard to get at. Playing golf. Playing golf, mate, yeah. Look at this guy just golfing his He's golf just playing ball. Golf. <laughs> He's just playing golf. Golfing his golf ball. Golfing his ball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to golf my balls next week. Balls, hopefully it's just one ball for you. Just for the week. Yeah, one ball, but. Type. Them Callaway balls are running out. Bring <laughs> me down. Roads no. in villas. <laughs> Easily done that here, though. We've got a tournament tomorrow um, at Villa Pedana. 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 Uh, playing the Flamingos course, which we played it today. Well, we didn't play it today. We just, we just drove around the buggy, basically, and I look. Put, put it to the whole locations. Yep. So got a little idea of how the greens are running mm -hmm. and played the course a lot and it's right there in front of you. So it's nice to kind of recharge the batteries today. Yeah. Get ready for tomorrow. Yeah, it looks like a good spot. It looks like there's just a bit more room you can hit. A few more drivers, a few more part fives. Greens are bigger. Yeah. So I think the scoring is probably going to be a bit better. The, the forecast again is pretty much the same every day. It's like 18 to 20, not much wind. So. Lovely stuff. Right. Fine darts. Yeah. Anything else to say? What was your best shot then? What was my best shot? Uh, the putt to get in the playoff. Yeah. That's so said. gay, isn't it? That's not no, my I best don't... shot. My best shot was <laughs> on the 16th hole in the first round when I flared my driver out right and mm. I'm in the bunker. I've got 235 to the flag down the hill. Up. Right to left slope. Oh, the one I saw? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, hit a bullet cut to a front right flag. Yeah. 20 I saw feet this. and roll it in. So, so was... like, behind the, he was playing the group behind me. I was, I was on the next tee looking back and, like, looked over and you could see it was, like, 240 yards away. So his ball come out the bunker, like, just, like, hangs up above the flag, <laughs> pitches on the front of the green. That was a good shot. Yeah. Not, roll it in, which was nice. Yeah, that helps as well. It. That's the type of shot that there's not many people could hit and actually swing in over 120. Yeah, yeah. No, so it was, it was a very cool week and just excited to keep moving on and it's just the start really, isn't it? Yeah, so keep yeah, going. he's got Q school in whenever it is now because yeah. they've delayed it so now Leon's now staying with me for longer, which is good. There's another update, Harry Flowers coming down there. Oh jeez! <laughs> <laughs> Flowers coming down next Tuesday. 
which is a great day for him to come down because he is a bit of a see you next Tuesday it's <laughs> <laughs> a low blow man yeah. you teed it up for yourself I you I teed it up for yourself <laughs> I had it in the back of my mind all day to be honest um, so yeah that's going to be fun he's actually going to play a bit as well so um, I think he might be caddying me for an event um, which may go one or two ways either I will wrap him around a flag or I, no it'd probably just go one way and that would be it no, I think it'll be really good. I think it'll be great to have his opinion and your opinion Jesus on the channel so that you can give your opinion first and then Caddy can give like the brutally honest plus he's going to try and get a little giant, like a little couple jibes in there. So it just it'll just be good entertainment. <laughs> it'll be good entertainment. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. I hope this is, you know, all right content. I haven't really been able to feel much, but it showed me on winning which is the best and just a little update we'll be coming back with some more content this weekend yeah so we're going to get this get this tournament out of the way and then after that we've got we've Saturday Sunday we've, we've got, got Saturday, Saturday Sunday, Sunday so we're going to do something special on one of the days we're going to get out there's talks of Valderrama so that's a possibility but don't get your hopes up on that mm. um, yeah <laughs> oh, the oh. golf purse will be uh, yeah. tingling chopped up thought. <laughs> but whatever we do we'll have, we have a good day again we'll make a vlog that'll be smashing won't it it'll be absolutely wonderful super smashing great alright then alright brr brr I have to go to bed brr turn the dundies turn the bedding off bedding bars thank you good night much love thank you good night